Let's play Mountain Blade War Band. I am here with Violet near Gudan, which I'm planning to siege. But uh, before I do that, I will quickly visit Violet's castle to get some better troops. In the previous episode, uh, it was mostly peacetime. I did some peaceful trading with Violet and some uh, politics. Tried to convince lords to give Violet the marshalship. But uh, it went to Mundhalir just before the war between the Saranid Sultanate and the Rodog started again as the Sultan declared war against the Rodogs. And I immediately dumped everything I was doing and uh, set my target to Kudan, which is a uh, town here on north that the uh, Rodogs took from the Gertzits who had taken it from the from the Nords a bit before. And uh, Since the town is pretty far from the Rodog main main territory and uh, even their closest castle, uh, they don't necessarily come come and try to take Kudan by full force. If I happen to happen to uh, happen to get it. What I'll do here is I will, I will leave my cavalry. At least get the cavalry off my off my current party. I will also also get rid of all these uh, all these rookies I have here. I want to go in with the best possible arm. We get who's cars that give us 34 infantry. Then, uh, master archers, sharpshooters, that's 35. Let's get the lone hired blade there as well. Some. Let's take ten more archers. I guess I will. Oh no. I want to. Do I have any? Turns. Don't I just have the great ones. Guess I will fill up with the Mamluks. Fill up with the Mamluks and I actually can really these guys as well. Some looks will help if I happen to run into run into armies I need to defeat. So the one one thing I do here is so how many, how many troops we have here now? 174 Oops, that's the wrong one. Hmm. 
thing is I need to if I get Kudan I need to get troops groups there from Rinduar because there's not enough and not trained enough troops here so I will send the cavalry So to that will. Let's, let's put these casters then uh, let's send those guys to into our castle yes that's okay then I want you to go and recruit some lords here thank you okay now we are Finally, ready to go to. Uh, we have the recruiter going to recruit some nords, and we have the troops moving automatically to into our castle. Hopefully, they will make their safe, make their way safely. We still have some troops in our castle, and uh, in case it, it would get sieged. We would ride in and, and help it. And speaking of sieging, the road dogs just sieged Saris. And um, that is actually perfect opportunity for me to take Kudan. As, as they are seating Saris on the other side of the map, probably with their full, full force. So uh, they can't come and defend the town here. Okay. Siege it, prepare letters and do it. What kind of words we have? Shot pretty much right away, but uh, what I did was to was order ordered cavalry cavalry in the middle, the infantry up front, and archers on the back, everyone holding still. And I'm missing all these guys instead of hitting them. And uh, by doing this, we can do some damage, damage to the defending forces. Actually, let's uh, stand a bit closer so we can get into the middle. I personally haven't done a very good job here. I've missed pretty much all the arrows I've shot. Now I'm getting shot, that's not good. 
Luckily, I didn't die. Who the heck is shooting me? That was way too close. Oh, they are shooting. Oh, they are shooting from the far away towers. Hitting something, killing you. Okay, I'm out of arrows. Pick these ones from the yeah, sunlight there. Arrows just. I was I was hoping to do more more damage. More damage than this. But, uh, yeah, we lost that part of the fight. Fight eight. Maybe of ten. Uh, okay, we gained some morale back. Lost morale because we had to have to retreat and uh, we got some back as we still want to fight. Okay, we will do that again. something which is a bit better because these these guys in the tall towers or high towers are somewhat tricky to them to the computer they can they can handle these uh, defenders defenders up on the up on the wall pretty well arrows please yes thank you After clearing the towers, we might soon send in some infantry. We could take yet another break. Do this one more time.
What? Still alive. Damn it. Okay, let's take that again then. Lost morale because of retreating, but gained because we won that battle. So 42 of them killed. If my calculations are right, there is... Maybe 70 of them left, if that. Oh no no, no one rush in, no one rush in there, give me some space here please, infantry, cavalry, archers, and get them somewhere around there, okay let's clear those crossbowmen, Final assault. I think that is it. I'll let the let archers do their do their thing. Nine. About that. First, first person view behind the Huskar shield and see all the action. Or we can use the third person view and actually see something. One renown for taking town, but all oh, worth it. Why so little? Uh, I guess it's just the one battle. Oh well. And 
and uh, guess I'll take all those guys just to put them into the into the garrison. Hmm, it's not the worst. It's not the worst armor. Maybe a companion can use it, and yes, I want Kudan to be awarded to me. That's what we'll do it for now. Let's put you guys in there. And then I will need to rush. Rush to. So what do I want to do? So I'll use those guys as well and take the memo hooks just in case. I might try to get one of these troops. I'll try to take the knights. So I, now I need to rush to the Rinduar castle and Some reinforcements here first. For those who haven't been watching, I'm using the Diplomacy mod, which has that, that item pool functionality. Okay, Rolf is wearing heraldic colors, and Yeremus is still wearing the skirt. How lovely. Except there shouldn't be, there is still troops there to defend it, or it will not be automatically captured. Captured if the enemy forces come to it. Oh, now I need to be careful and not run into anything and remember that I am. You can't pass there, fool. Need to be careful not to run into any big armies, but I am fast as I'm going. I'm using cavalry at the moment. Okay. One of the Rodark Lords is there in the southeast. There, Violet has the Asukan Castle and the village to guard. It has not been looted. The castle itself is safe, I believe. Medium sized groups are there. Maybe around 80 or something. And the Rodarks took Saris. Alrighty. Okay, let's um, first. Let's first ask the constable to move some troops to. Troops to Kudan. So 
Here we have the troops that were moved here from Jamalak Castle. So let's send those guys where we can go to. So I'll send all of you to me. Okay, so that's group to go down. Yes, you need. I think you are still training troops here. Yes, you are. That's good. That's money I have. It's a thousand. Who's the dresser? That's good too. Okay, so let's take... Let's take the camera troops. To train those those guys while at it and that's it, that's one guy. My own infantry. Okay, so that'll give me mostly Mostly cavalry. But now the question is: Should I leave Windwar Castle with 200 troops not too well trained? Mostly recruits. I think I will trust. Trust that. Those troops make it to Udan. Let's see what the road dogs will do next. There is one army there. One army that I can catch. Mm. The, the 
problem with these um, these castles and places I have is that they are quite spread out and just nowhere. There hasn't been real strategy in capturing these castles and what what castles to take and so on. But, uh, I think it's still been, still been okay. Mm. I think I will move some troops from here. Hoax of Rodox. And this is a huge Kudan as well. Then in here, I think you could go and make room some. Some serendipity. Yes. Thank you. Hmm. One thing I could do is go for this. This castle right here that would give me free castles here and there. Here in the middle. I'm not sure if I want to be in the middle later. And this castle is heavily defended. Uh, now that road dogs have Saris. It might be possible to possible to take Saris uh, at least after after a while when the troops have left the town. Haven't seen. Haven't seen too many reports. Reports around the area. Ooh, the truce between the Serenids and the Nords is over. Now I hope they don't go and declare war on us right away. Now that we are no longer in cruise. Yeah. I wanted to test these test these patrols so uh, I think I will go with a small elite patrol. It will be interesting to uh, put out a patrol from the garrison, as then I can put the troops in there and make them make them much better. But let's take a small elite patrol and 
put it in Lindwar Castle. Yes. Because I think that will put the patrol. Okay, there it is. Where is it? How did it come from? Where it will come from? There it is. Will you patrol now? Yes, you will. Excellent. Okay, the main main purpose of patrol like this is of course to... Uh, if that patrol gets destroyed, we know that there is an enemy nearby. Actually, why don't I... Why don't I... Uh, Buy one right here and just send it there. It's it's two thousand. It's not not exactly cheap. It uh, would be better for. Ah, okay. I can't can't do it from the same town. Or castle. Okay, let's go. Let's go see the situation in. In Kudan, which Sultan gave to Violet. Alright, I think I think getting a town means that I can get a counselor uh, who can do some diplomacy stuff. A bit like the constable. Constable does for army and Chamberlain for the treasury. I believe it's the diplomacy mod feature that the uh, Chancellor, but I'm not sure as I haven't played the Warband this far without the mod. And um, 40 troops. That's a big campaign. Ah. And of course you want to. Of course you want to take Saris back. Can I get these guys? I think I can before they reach Rivari. And I should really remember to level up Violet. Because I got that level. Level then level in that seat, so let's do that. Mm. I put intelligence to eighteen. That means that I can put trainer up one point the one extra point comes from the book I'm carrying. That's why there's a green point there. The maximum is 6, but I have it at 7. And then... Uh, guess I could put tactics to 2, so this way all these skill points at Skills at two points. Violet will continue to continue to support the whole party, even that the companion is taking the main responsibility for that. For example, for the pathfinding plus one, spotting plus one, engineering plus one, surgery, recruitment, all, all those plus ones are there because Violet's having. Violet has them. Has the points in it. Okay, uh, so you don't know me, but know me, but we have relations well. Well, by the way, you are going down. And, uh, I 
believe I'm pretty much all cavalry. Here, so uh, I guess we will just char charge these charge these road dogs. We could go and join join Mundhalir taking Saris, but I'm not sure if I want to go there. That's a lot of road dogs. So we can't take that castle. Derkia's castle probably only has yeah. So that's definitely takeable if I'd like to take it. I'm thinking if if the Nords declare war on us, which they probably will. They will declare war on either us or the road dogs. I'm pretty sure of that. And uh, if the Nords declare war on the Saranids, quest cancelled. So I didn't make it on time, so the, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hmm. Okay, now here's an interesting. Man, that is, that is huge army. And this green what must be must be a Swadian lord or something because he has Swadian knights and men at arms and Wow, well I, I certainly can't can't go and fight him. Accompany, who are you accompany? Oh no 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 you are not going to win Duar, are you? Apparently not. Oh, damn it. I'm guessing these troops will go and defend. Defend Saris. Interesting if this this one guy has larger army than 
those guys combined were almost almost at least Oh shoot, there it comes. Mm. Yeah, that's that's what I was afraid of. Ah. The Seranids are at war against both Nords and the Rodogs, and the Nords and Rodogs only have war against the Seranids. So, uh, guess who will be losing that one? But, uh, we don't get that much about the Seranids, but the problem is that. Uh, the way my castles are placed here and put on um, it's totally possible that the other faction will go against go to Kudan and the other go against one of my castles okay we get to get to appoint the Chancellor so uh, let's appoint that. We need to go to. We need to go to. Um, go to Kudan and see what we can do with the Chancellor. Let's first deal with this Nord guy here. It's not a good terrain for us, but luckily there's not too many of them. Should be quite, quite easy to also charge them down. These are definitely not Nord troops by origin. If, if the Nords decide to attack Kudan, which they are very likely to do, unfortunately. Need to need to see if I even want to fight or do I just give up the place. But uh, while there at least we can go check it out. And, uh, 
to actually fight you. Fight you before you do anything stupid like go and see it's good on. Yeah, well, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna humiliate you even more, and uh, since you so insist, this time I will take you as a prisoner, and I will not let you go, and I will lock you down in one of my prisons. So, uh, prepare for that, Olaf. Poor, poor fellow did a suicide, suicide charge straight into my troops and uh, I think we know what's gonna happen in this fight with these, these troops. Our army of Swadian knights and Mamluks against them. Group of Rodog, uh, I mean Nord. Nord soldiers. Oh, oh, lots of them got rooted. Let me get this guy as a prisoner. Ha! You are my prisoner now. And I'm not letting go. I'm sorry. Mm, I guess I'll dump the guy into the door. Oh no. With, with the war against the Nords and the Rodogs who control most of Calvadia combined, I'm losing six, 14 towns worth of income and in that puts me into negative, which hasn't happened in a long time. Okay, let's let's go towards Kutan because that's where that's where we need to need to fight fight to defend the place. Although if if the Nords decide that they will they will take Kudan 
well, they will pretty much take Gudan. As uh, the Nords have, they are the biggest faction, and they have been been in peace for uh, I don't remember how long, very long time. So uh, they all have big armies. They all have. Uh, There is an army, army here. Yeah, two of them. Oh shoot. Yeah, they have they have big armies, just as I said. This guy has two towns, one castle, one village, renowned seven eight one. This guy has many castles. He's cooperative towards you. Well, okay. That is very unlikely to stop him from attacking me. Now, one of those armies I could try and take, but. Uh, both of them, they seem to accompany each other. Oh no 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 no! Oof! Just made it. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, let's go see what the canceller can do. Let's also sell stuff here. Those gold plates and we need helmet for companion, but I just just remembered what the financial situation is now. So I really can't afford it. Okay, canceller. Uh, can I ask the Nords not to attack my, my town? What are you doing here? Who are you? I'm here in my castle and you come to ask who I am. Guess you are one of the new guys. Chancellor Herfast. Household possessions, okay. Domestic policy. Okay, that is probably related to the part where, where I have my own kingdom. Fifty dinars for sending a gift. That's not much, but I won't send anything now. Message to a lord. Mm. 
problem here is that I'm pretty much on my own. If and when the Nord decide to come for Kudan. And why, why would they attack any other town? It's right, right here and there, next to their territory. There's a Tundra Bandit Lair, right there with them. And now I can't get a quest for it. Can't get a quest for, for it because I'm the Lord here, but can I get a quest for that from the Guildmaster instead? No, there, there is, there is no way I can do any battle missions right now. Yes, yes, right away, right, 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 far away. No, 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 don't go there. Stop accompanying him. Rinduar Castle, eh? <laughs> oh. The Nord besieges Rinduar, and if you read the message at the bottom left, see what we have here next. Reindy Castle besieged by Rodogs. Perfect. Just perfect. Okay, let's go see what they have in mind. Yeah, I, I remember saying something about the factions going after two of my settlements at the same time. And what do you know? On the same minute they do it. Just like they, they are coordinating their efforts or something. Okay, Kletty, you will be a persuasion lady. So I guess I will. What else? Like, we will take the intelligence too. To 15 and just keeping 4 points of persuasion right away. I've been needing to persuasion when I finally get the kingdom going. I need I need diplomats to send a mission send a, send to a mission to uh, persuade lords to join me and uh, negotiate peace and uh, Things like that. Of course, I can do those things with Violet, but then with, with several companions doing the same thing, I can send them all over the land at the same time if needed. Which might be especially important if, uh, if we are at war. Now that I think of it, I, I don't actually care that much about these castles. These guys can have them, but I do want... Oh shoot, that's a lot of them. Yeah. These guys these guys can have these castles, but I, I do care about the troops in them. Oh man, just as I entered the castle, the Nords broke the siege. Do you see that? Why the heck did you do that? So you decided it's not worth it? Something happened? No. Man, there was a lot of looting, pretty much every, 
every place was looted that there is. So you're not gonna see it's my castle. But the road dogs are seeding. Where are you going? That was so weird. The road dogs are road dogs are not giving up. I think. Well, I'd like that. I'd like to see Windwar Castle go. Oh, is the battle? Oh, whoa, 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 the battle is already going on. Oh, no. Hmm, 800 of them. It would be 380 of us. Now that's an interesting, interesting, uh, interesting situation we have right there. So I could go and try to defend the place. The bubble missed the troops in. Troops in the garrison are... They are very... Very untrained, we have tribesmen and recruits. Mm -hmm. And the army I have is pretty much all cavalry. If I had infantry and Infantry and uh, archers, I could go and defend the place. As it is now... I think Randy Castle is lost. And, uh, I don't think I can go in there and... Change the do changes to the garrison, and it looks like that our troops are not riding in here. Oh, n oh man! Are you kidding me? Now to north. Oh shh. Now the Nords went in and started their siege. After all, should have went into the garrison and sent those troops out. Man. Wait a minute. Ha 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 ha! Yes! We made peace with the road dogs. As the battle in Randy Castle was going on. But that, that siege will now be over and I will keep the castle. The guys, guys were there on the walls. Defending the place. And then uh, they received the news that... Uh, it's peace. What the heck? There's only... Hmm? There's only one hundred and something troops. Oh, 
Oh man, I, I need to do this. This one I can stop. Very nice. So they... Their main forces left and went... I don't know where they went. Somewhere. And some of them returned. Returned and now all the rookie troops are getting slaughtered. Uh, but I will, I will join the fight. I wonder if this guy would join, but uh, well, I guess I'll do without him. Yeah, now it's a, now it's an even even match. Oh, oh, oh! I always forget. I should have taken three packs of arrows for myself, so I don't always run out. Oh, this is this is the place where they they will come. They will come. That's high, high climb. So I run around without doing anything instead of killing those guys. Damn it! I guess they are. They have their crossbow men down there and shooting at us. I'm trying to. the only guy left. Just 
trying to trying to shoot us. Is there any arrows for me in here? Somewhere. Can I really can't jump over this? There you go. Is that the last one? No. There's some arrows. I saw some arrows. Just one arrow. I saw it somewhere. Good shield. Bolts. Sabers. I can't jump this. Oh, no, I can. Where is that one guy? Hmm? Is he there? Oh, man. Hey, arrows. Ah, they are all turned to wall. Okay, now where is this lone guy? There he is, he's stuck somewhere. Hit you once, I hit you twice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so four got killed from my party, not much from the from the garrison and all of their troops. <laughs> Thanks for your help, ma'am. Well, <laughs> thank you. Uh, yeah. You are my prisoner. Just one? Oh, man. Oh, yeah, we get shirtless dudes into the garrison. Yes. Perfect. Perfect defenders and baits for these road dogs. But oh boy, were we lucky with the with the other other seeds. The road dogs were winning like were winning by a mile, and then uh, suddenly we are at peace. That was that was funny. Uh, no, I'm not gonna upgrade you. I'm gonna put you there without your shirts. Yeah, this this place needs more troops now. Guess I could give you the sharpshooters and get these guys for me and train them up. Oh, I have the Chancellor here. Of course. Of course I do. And go recruit some good seats. Yeah. Thanks, bye. Okay. How come the seats is still on? Yes, come here. Here. You join now, and you didn't join. Well, I will take this guy down myself. And uh, since Olaf asked for it, I will, uh, I will get you all as prisoners. And if the choice was mine, I would slay you in my dungeons, but I can't.
Let's do it. Skulls don't have shit on us. Stupid things the Nords have done, but the dumbest thing they've done is come after my castle. So there will be no forgiveness. No forgiveness for them. Not this time. Because this time... It's personal. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying all that stuff. <laughs> It's <laughs> I guess it goes with the goes with all its game. His tool, his tool will be, he will be a lord one day, a vessel for Violet, so let's keep that in mind. Mm. I think we can keep putting points of charisma from now on. Leadership we want, we probably want some pathfinding. Uh, but leadership will be the most important one, so let's put points to that. Mitsar will remain as Violet's personal bodyguard. As a uh, Even, even that his backstory says so, he's not noble, as I might have mentioned in the previous episode, but anyway, or one of the previous episodes. Um, hmm, but what do we do with you? Then. I guess you could be the tactician. Let's start upping that. But with agility 15, so we can increase the weapon mastery and maybe riding. Yeah. Wonder if the mods will return. What do we do? What is that? That is a cool graphical glitch, like someone is sending. Wonder if that is showing on the, on the video or not. Come on. Yeah, um, I will end the episode here. <laughs> As those mountain tops are missing the messaging me with some Morse code. That's a fun glitch. And uh, we will continue next time, but uh, now the war against the road dogs. This time it's personal. 
until then, take care, and bye bye. And of course I mean to war against the Lords, but uh, even then, uh, next time, war. See you later.